To infinity and your mom. No, that's not right. To indecency and respond. No, that's not right either. Hey guys, me host Superzoro. Thank you very much for tuning in. Look what I got! It's Ducky and Bunny. Oh, I love these. These are the best part of the Toy Story 4 trailers so far. They use Ducky and Bunny, if you remember, to um, kind of announce the Toy Story movie with a little sneak preview. And it featured these two going back and forth with the famous catchphrase of To Infinity and Beyond and changing it to things like To Infinity and Your Mum. <laughs> The fact that they use these two is hilarious, and the voices that come out of them are even funnier. So I couldn't resist in picking up as much Bunny and Ducky merchandise as I could humanly find. So far, I've got, so far, I've got the little, the little uh, minis. I've got the little minis. I want to get the mystery minis from Funko. I also want to get the regular Funkos. I want to get the plushies, and now I've got the action figures. I'm starting a collection of these boys because these are awesome. So I'm going to break these out of the package, you guys, and we'll talk about it. We'll take a look at these figures. There are other figures that you can get in the range. Pardon me. Including Woody, Bo Peep, Slinky Dog, Forky, Buzz, Jesse, Rex, and the new guy. <laughs> Who is basically Evil Knievel. And I've even looked at the toy, and it is literally the Evil Knievel bike that you wind up and he shoots off. But they've called him something like, is it like Rocket Dan or Dangerous Dan or something? Dan, not Dangerous Dan, that smells. But yeah. You know what I mean. So, there's a little blurb on the back of here that states, in the new chapter, <coughs> it, <coughs> sorry, it, try again. It's a new chapter in the lives of Woody, Buzz, and the Toy Story gang from their new kid Bonnie's house to an exciting road trip. They'll encounter friends old and new and face all kinds of adventures along the way. Now, these toys are by Mattel in partnership with Disney. So let's break Ducky and Bunny out of the boxes. So yeah, I, as soon as they saw, I saw these two on that trailer, I was howling with laughing listening to them. And then, then they did the Super Bowl trailer, where Ducky's basically kicking Buzz Lightyear in the head. <laughs> Up here, Astro Boy! <laughs> you think you can take my top prize spot? <laughs> I love that trailer so much. And Super Sorrel Jr. loves that trailer so much. We laugh so much at that. So... Me and Super Soul Jr. have really found something in common with Ducky and Bunny. We both love their stupid humour. So let's just get a Bunny out as well. Come on, Bunny. Whoop. Alright. Try and put those two on. There we go. Right, so we have Ducky. Ow! Remember, kids, always put scissors on the desk so they don't fall in your feet. Oh, that hurt like hell. I've got one foot. I've only got one real foot, and I nearly cut it off. Clever, Sorrel. So, Keegan-Michael Kay and Jordan Peele are the voices of Ducky and Bunny, respectively. Here are Ducky and Bunny, of course. Eee, I'm so glad I have these now. I'm so happy. <laughs> so, Ducky... Uh, his head does rotate, so you can get him to look around. His little birdie arms do flap, Whee! and guess what? He even has full kicking action, so you can make him kick Buzz in the head as many times as you want at home. And they also rotate outwards as well. So, nice little bit of articulation. I, I weren't expecting much articulation out of these, but actually there is, so it's quite cool. So there's Ducky, and of course we've got Bunny. A bunny's kind of similar, his head rotates as well. I think even his ears are articulated, you can flick them back and forwards, so that's nice. He doesn't have his tag though, obviously they have, he had a little hook tag in the trailer. Um, obviously they haven't included that, just probably for safety reasons. Uh, his arms do lift up and do rotate at that hinge there as well. And the legs also have a little bit of articulation in them as well, going back and forward as well as outwards. So that's decent for a little uh, cheap toy. These are what I consider pocket money toys, they were just uh, £9 each from Smith's in the UK. Smith's toys, so I couldn't I couldn't resist picking up big six inch well nearly seven inches some of the, that one especially big versions of these anyway are definitely something I wanted for display in my room just because it's Ducky and Bunny man they're hilarious in that trailer. Oh, what do you think the first time you saw them in the trailer, guys? Were you excited to see them? Let me know in the comments. But let but let me go to the desk cam and give you guys a bit of an up close personal look at Ducky and Bunny first hand. So let's go to the desk cam.
So here they are, guys, out of the packaging. These are awesome. I really like these. They look really cool. They're quite big as well. I didn't realize how big these things were. They're really tall. Um, let me, let me, I need to find something just to show you how big these things are, just to put them into perspective for you. These are massive. He's like seven or eight inches tall. These are huge. Maybe even more, actually. I ain't got any six inch figures around me. But I've got a, I've got a, I've got a Jurassic Park Mattel figure. <laughs> that, that shows you something. <laughs> Don't know what that shows you, but it shows you something. <laughs> But we have Ducky and Bunny, <laughs> I have no idea. We have Ducky and Bunny though, out of the packaging. And they are fun little characters, I really love them. To indecency and respond! No, that's not right. No, that's not right. <laughs> to insanity and oblong! <laughs> And the bit in the beginning where he says, um, I don't care what kind of pet you're from, give me back my Viewmaster or I'll knock the damn floppy face. Oh, you're an I don't care bear. <laughs> oh, they need, Pixar needs to just make a Ducky and Bunny movie. If they don't make a spin-off called Ducky and Bunny, I'll be very upset. Disney Plus, come on, Disney Plus, give us that. <laughs> give us it now. Take all my money and just give me a Ducky and Bunny TV series. With the fact they've hired two really decent actors... Like Jordan Peele and, and my uh, Keegan Michael Kay, there's no way they're just going to be using them as one-offs, right? They can't just have like a five-second scene in this movie to hire those actors. They must be thinking long term with them. They really must. So I'm really hoping beyond hope we get something a little bit extra in these two, uh, a spin-off or something, a little short cartoon, anything, because they're so funny. I I really enjoy them. Uh, laughing at them especially at the end when Buzz and Woody come on and say to infinity and beyond and he's like you can't go to infinity dummy it's impossible I'm gonna go beyond infinity you know nothing about science <laughs> love them guys what do you think of Ducky and Bunny let me know in the comments down below but let's go back to the main cam and finish off the video so guys, let me know your thoughts on Ducky and Bunny in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video guys, please smash the subscribe button. It would really support us, really help us out and help us keep making awesome videos. If you subscribe as well, I'll make sure to do more Toy Story 4 merchandise. So subscribing is going to really support this channel. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. May the force be with you and to infinity and oblong. Bye! <laughs>